Hey guys, so in the previous video we used uh, fractions as operators, but we used proper fractions. So a proper fraction is any time when, let's say, the numerator is smaller than the denominator. Oh, there's something wrong with my cookie now. But we can also use improper fractions. So for example, if I wanted to know four thirds, or one and a third, of, let's say, 27. I could do the same thing. So the, the important thing to remember is all, I always multiply with the numerator and I always divide by the denominator. Um, it's not about the biggest or the smallest number. It's about the top number and the bottom number. So in this case, um, I'm not going to multiply by four first. I'm going to divide by three first because then I'm going to have a smaller number, which I, I like. But you can multiply by four if you if you wanted to and then divide by three but it's easier for me to say 27 divided by three because i know that is nine and then nine times four i know is 36. so important note here is if i if i use an improper fraction uh, in my calculation my number will always increase so if you looked at the previous examples, let's say we wanted three uh, quarters of, I don't know, 20. And I, let's say I worked that out, I would have said, okay, well, 20 uh, divided by four would be five. And then I would say five times three, that would be 15. So what happened here is you can see I used a, a proper fraction of my number or quantity and it actually became less because obviously this is less than one. But this is more than one, so if I'm gonna use this, it will become larger. So we had 27 and it became larger because this is actually one and a third.